Hi, this is Daniel and in today's video I would like to show you how you can put text behind any kind of object in DaVinci Resolve. Ok, so let's say that this is our video and we would like to our text to appear from behind this mountain. So first of all, of course, we have to add some kind of text into our video. For this, I will go towards the effects at the top left. I will go to titles and drag the text above our video track. Now, of course, I will fit the length to fit our video. And then we will go towards the inspector and set up everything around the text we would like to use. So in our case, let's say that we want the text to be just text and we want to use, for example, the Open Sans extra bold font, a little bit bigger. And I want it to be positioned more at the right, just like that. Now, of course, we need to mask this mountain because we want to put this text behind. For this, we have to duplicate our video. For this, I will simply select this video, hold Alt and drag this video above our text effect. So hold Alt and drag this into our video track 3. So now, once again, we got video above our text so we can see text, but we are going to work on this in a second. So now we want to simply mask this mountain off. For this, we will go towards this color tab and here we will go towards this window and choose the pencil icon. Now we want to create the mask around this mountain. In case your mask have to have more details, you can easily zoom in or zoom out towards this image with your mouse scroll. And in case you will hold the mouse scroll, you can easily move with the image as well. So let's create the mask around this mountain. And in case, of course, you would like to delete any kind of your points, you can click the mouse scroll button to delete the point. Okay, so now our mask is done. So now in case we would like to actually see the text behind this mountain, we can right click towards this window and we will add alpha output. Now we can see that the blue circle appeared at the right and we can simply link it with this blue square. And as soon as we will link those two, our text will appear from behind our masked object. Now I like to play with the softness a little bit. Thanks what those edges will not be so sharp. So let's set the softness for example for one and the outside softness for 0.24. Let's say it might work in our case, but of course, in case it would not, we can play with those also later. So now we set up the mask for this mountain and we can see our text appearing from behind this mountain. But of course, we set up the mask only for one frame. And as this video is going, we need to move with the mask. As we don't want to move with every point one by one frame by frame, we can go towards the tracker and we can track forward and reverse thanks what the DaVinci Resolve will learn where the object is moving and how to actually track those layers of the mountain. Ok, so now as we could see the tracking should be done and the process should be over. In case some of your mask points would not fit the edge of the objects you are trying to track, you can simply switch from clip to frame and then at that certain frame simply move with any of those points. Because at the clip, in case you would change any of those dots, it would change the position of the point for the entire clip length. But as soon as you would switch to frame, you are changing the mask points only for this certain frame. Ok, but we should be done. This is how you can add text behind any kind of moving objects in DaVinci Resolve. So that's all for today's video. Really hope you found out what you were looking for. Hope you are good and video fine. Thanks for watching and all of the support and see you all next time.